What's up everybody, Father Minitachi here, you know what it is. We are here today with an unboxing video for that Pokemon 20th Anniversary Nintendo 3DS. This is the America version, and if I don't recall, uh, elsewhere in the world they had things like the specified 2DS versions, uh, a yellow one, blue one, red one, and depending on where you were located, maybe a green one? I don't know. But um, I know in the U.S. you got a 3DS, a new Nintendo 3DS, which was very unique for the U.S. because um, we don't have that many of the new versions, which is the small, cool-looking ones. Um, we get a bunch of the XLs and all that stuff. But um, we got that new Nintendo 3DS version for the Pokemon 20th Anniversary, and it came with two uh, different faceplates, a red version and a blue version. And, of course, downloaded into the game, came with the red and blue. Um, later on, you're going to see a half code for the, um, there's this wallpaper that you can, uh, a theme, theme paper, um, that you can use in the 3DS, and it's a red theme and a blue theme, of course, and what else did we get? Um, pretty much, oh, so you got the uh, Nintendo 3DS with the two faceplates, the red and blue, you got the themes inside the 3DS for the red and blue, and you also got the red and blue games. Uh, versions downloaded onto the Nintendo 3DS as well, so that would be very cool. But let's go ahead and get started with the um, the video itself, the unboxing part. Boom! Here it is. Here's that case, as you can already see. Got that Nintendo um, 3DS logo on the top left. You got the Pokemon Red and Pokemon Blue on the top right. Got all the ra random rubbish on the bottom that no one really cares about. We got the barcode on the left with the Nintendo 3DS logo, and then on the other side, really cool logo. Um, Pokemon 20th Anniversary logo, and then on top, of course, the new Nintendo 3DS as well as Pokemon. <clears throat> In the front, we've got, again, the bottom left is the red, the upper right is the blue, and then on the back, it shows you basically the basics that come with a Nintendo 3DS. So, we're going to go ahead and slice this bad boy open. Didn't have any tape, so we were good to go. There's the contents inside. We're going to go ahead and start off with the boring content, of course. Um, get that out of the way, ASAP. Pretty much... Here is the boring content. We are going to start off with the AR cards. Um, these actually aren't boring. These are pretty cool, but they're very standard in a lot of the 3DSs now. Um, they come with like six different AR cards and they're for various different games and all that stuff. Here's that thing I was talking about, that theme code. Shows you how to download the, th uh, the theme code onto your uh, new Nintendo 3DS. Very cool themes, to be honest. I've already played with them. Very cool. And here is the booklet to show you how the new Nintendo 3DS XL works, as well as a, another booklet for... I mean, I'm not even going to read these booklets, but he comes with the system, and it's kind of mandatory, because some people like to read these things. Next up, we've got the faceplates. Now, here is the blue faceplate from Pokemon Blue version. This is the bottom. This is the one that goes on the back. And this is the one that you have to actually screw into the system. The top, you don't have to. And pretty much it's got that cool little 20th anniversary Pokemon um, logo on the bottom left. Here's some more um, cardboard that i got to get out in order to get the other uh, part of the faceplate. This is the Blastoise version, and it is really cool. Um, I'm a fan of red, the color red, so I'm using the other one. But this is a really cool faceplate. You can see Blastoise owning it up. Rar, rar, and rar. But um, we've got that 20th anniversary Pikachu, so that's very cool to have as well on these faceplates. It's really cool, and it feels really nice as well. Um, let's go ahead and grab the uh, 3DS system itself out of the box. The box is now empty. Um, but when it comes, I'm not sure if they're random on if you get the red or the blue faceplate on. But mine came with the red, so I don't really. I got kind of lucky. I don't have to really mess around with it too much. Um, the bottom, like I said, you do have to screw it on, and the red faceplate on my 3DS is already screwed onto the system, so I don't have to worry about that at all. But the upper part of the um, faceplate, I'm gonna have to. All you have to do is just clip it in; it fits perfectly, and you don't have to worry about much as well. I know I did put this upside down right in the beginning, and it actually didn't even clip on. It's just sitting there right now, um, as you can see on the bottom. But when you open it up, it would be upside down Charizard, so half and half. But um, I just come by, I just switched it around. So there is the full faceplate, Pikachu 20th anniversary logo on the bottom left, and there's the actual 3DS itself. Really cool system. I can't wait to start playing Pokemon Red and Pokemon Blue, and of course I will be downloading Yellow. Let me know what you think about Pokemon Moon. 
and Pokemon Sun. What are you going to get first? I know we, it's really early. We don't know which legendaries we're getting yet. But here's that blue face plate one last time. Thank you very much for tuning in. For the win, Itachi is out.